Hello, this is the non-popular website that I would like to share with my colleagues. Its name is Newsmap and you can access it by typing that web address in your browser. And basically what you're looking at is a visual representation of Google News. So what you find in the standard versions of Google News is what you will find also in the Newsmap. All of these different squares have different sizes because they correspond to the frequency of each one of these articles. There's another part that I really like, which is all the topics are over here in different colors and are represented over here. And the different tones of each one of these colors also signifies how long ago these articles were published. Now let's expand these once again and I am going to do a quick search for Ebola. And I am choosing Ebola because it's a word that is spelled more or less the same way in many countries. And you will see that in the US, a lot of what is reported on Ebola is coming from the health sections. Nonetheless, there are also some Ebola related news coming from the national sections, which are related to uh, elections, and also other uh, Ebola related articles in the technology section, which is how Microsoft uh, can provide help. So it is really nice to do it like this. And if I want to include other countries, in my search I can do so easily and in this case I am only going to look at Italy and the news about Ebola in Italy and if I click on any one of these um, articles I'm going to be sent there and immediately after I'm going to be asked if I want to translate that page and this happens only in Chrome I think. So uh, the page has been translated and I can read it, but for sure it, it still needs work and, but I can read it and that, and that is what is most important. Um, in the same way, I can uh, decide to see all of the countries at once and the, the news map website will combine all of the information, aggregate it all and provide me with results from all the countries regarding Ebola. And this means uh, a frequency count coming out of all of the all of the news media that have been aggregated into the news map. So I thought that you will find this website uh, useful. I do check it out almost on a daily basis and in a single view it gives me a good idea of what is being covered in the news.